This five spice pineapple port makes a speedy and delicious supper dish. I'm going to begin by warming the pan. Now I'm just going to spritz it with a little bit of olive oil. And now the first ingredient is some pineapple rings and they're in natural juice. I'm just going to drain those, lift the rings out and cut them across and again into quarters. And then once your pan's nice and hot, drop in the pineapple pieces. Try and have a pan large enough so that they'll sit in a single layer. I really want them to catch some lovely colour, so I'm going to sprinkle over a little bit of soft brown sugar just to help them to caramelise. You need about half a tablespoon. If you want the recipe for this, the link is in the description. And I'm just turning over the pineapple now and some of the pieces have really caught some beautiful colour and that is what we want to see. And once you're happy with the colour on your pineapple, I'm going to tip them out onto a plate here. Beautiful. And then pop the pan back on the heat. I'm going to add another quick spritz of oil to the pan. And then on this plate here, I've got some essential waitrose pork fillet. I've cut it into slices and I'm just going to drop that into the hot pan. Sprinkle over a little bit of Chinese fry spice. You need about a teaspoon. I'm just going to brown them off on each side. And now I'm going to add a little bit of the pineapple juice, about four tablespoonfuls, and about the same of water. And just a touch more of that sugar. And now that needs to cook down for about six minutes until the pork is cooked all the way through with no pink meat. And now I'm going to add the pineapple back to the pan. In it goes. And then just to season it up, a little bit of soy sauce. Another minute or so of cooking, make sure the pineapple's piping hot throughout and then all you need to do is finish it off with a little bit of fresh coriander, scatter that over the top and serve it with some rice and tender stem broccoli and for more lovely recipes don't forget to click to subscribe.